Oh yeah, the bombs are a thing now. I forgot they were this early. If you attack of a bomb, if you attack of a bomb, they light up. And now the bomb will sadly explode and do a lot of damage. So the unfortunate thing. I, there's a correct way to deal with the bombs. That wasn't it. I was just. <laughs> okay, I should be able to have enough. I need to kill that guy for a key. Apparently, in my house, there's a ton of hornets, and um, supposedly they can fly away with me, which that, just makes me think I have Beedra at my house. That's scary. Okay, I can take a minute to show how to deal with the bombs. That, that's why Beedra is horrifying. I don't care what I don't care what kind of lore Pokemon I have. Beedrill's the f like scariest one. Attack! If you attack a Drapion. Okay, hold on. What is Drapion? That's the Scorpion from Generation Four. Oh crap! And well, okay, let me show this off. A human-sized Scorpion as opposed to a human-sized. Okay, bee. yeah, but Drapion's If like Mario slow. uses his hammer, the bombs don't light up. But if they light up, do this. Trust me. Does it hurt you? Beatrill is a three foot B. Yes. Yes, it is. It's is it Digger could impale me and murder me. Because of. It's like that episode of Futurama. Because of a Drapion's size, this could counter. Well, this could count the tail, but isn't it like six or seven feet tall? So. We kill each of them at one at a time and then. No. 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 Okay. Speaking now, of I'm gonna do. I've never figured out if what I'm about to do is a glitch. I think it's right here. Speed. Hold on. Actually, okay, he comes out of that side, and if you. I think that's a glitch. I think. I feel the fact that he comes out of that side makes you think it's not. Yeah, but. Is there no way? But there? there's that hole mm -hmm. which. I, I was. I've seen people do some weird clipping, but what I was going to say. Speaking of ah, get in the door. Speaking of scorpions, me and uh, Carter didn't a cousin we have wasn't his house a built on a scorpion nest? It wasn't a cousin. Oh. All right. I, I Who was it again? Guy. Our dad knew a guy. Oh wait, yeah. And we went to the land where the guy was building his house. It was on a scorpion nest. So the smart way. Are you gonna power shell it to the max? No. I'm gonna do this the smart way. Which is to painstakingly. If I were to power shell, they would explode on the next turn and I would lose like all my. Oh. Health. So. I'm gonna have to. Heal in a second here. I could! Power shell and heal because actually I'll just kill. Uh, wait. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Can you, uh, can you guard yet? What? Can you guard yet? Hold on, so... I'll heal after this battle. I have a mushroom. I'm just trying to do light damage with a hammer. Just because when they're red, you can attack them in any order. And it... So I could technically do this. And get him to explode and then he'll just... Why did Party Mirrors only have one hit point? I don't know. Maybe it's because it's not an RPG. Mm, slappy boy. Mushroom! Glorious mushroom! None for you, a one hit to wonder! Fungus. Uh, boop. The fungus is your friend. I like a moon guess. Okay. I think I just poorly referenced the movie. Uh. Holly, Yowie Dungeon. 
<laughs> oh wait, no! No, no, Lost no, Lost some no. good people of the Yaoi Dungeon. Just like in the Waifu Wars. Oh, this the annoying Wars room! Sent some people to the um, Yaoi Dungeon. This uh, they might as well be dead. He is not good for this. Fall over and fall over. Why is Coops not? Because Wait, I did I say Coops? Yes. Oh, damn it. His name is Cooper, so you're not that far off. Wait, why is it Bayonetta party member? Bayonetta one didn't exist. <laughs> but look how helpful they are. I think like for good reason she should be in every game. <laughs> <laughs> I miss time, but look how helpless they are. It's great. Yeah, but you see, if Bayonetta was in the game, it would jack up the age rating. Alright. Okay. You didn't jack up Smash's age rating. That was part of my joke. A thing I don't know if it was true, but the developer. You know, actually, um, apparently, when they're making Bayonetta 2 for the Wii U, they tried a whole bunch of things. Because they were afraid that they were going, that um, Nintendo wasn't going to be on board with some of their decisions, because it was too adult for most of Nintendo stuff. But whenever they would slide, like um, for instance, Link's outfit, she they said to make it more revealing. Oh, yeah, yes. they, they gave it like a cravat yeah. so that it covered up more. And they Nintendo. were like, no, show more cleavage. Yeah. And then when they want to do something, they're like, no, nah, no, nah, no, nah, you can do whatever you want. Yeah. Then Nintendo literally uh, said, remove the undershirt. That's not being out of style. Well, they they were, they told them to do whatever they want, and they were trying to like be play it cool, but you know Nintendo was like really cool about it. Okay. You can tell they wanted so, that game. Yeah. yeah. Watch yeah. it with it fit in the mind. And the okay, I'm gonna be able to get my level up good. Which brings me to the point of you guys need to get Bayonetta two. It comes with Bayonetta one. Yes. I know. For free. Only physically. What? Digitally. You well, no shit, up. Sherlock. What? The digital, digital, the digital release of the game doesn't have Bayonetta one. Okay, yes, but if you buy a physical copy of Bayonetta two, you have to have yeah. Bay get Bayonetta one. Yes. Mm -hmm. But it's free, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Maybe someday. So. Yeah, I mean, I can play Bayonetta two. That's one of those. And see if Bayonetta 1's actually better. It's one of those I've been needing to get it, but like the time and money it took getting, you know, all this recording Ooh, an extra power junk block. and all that. Good, 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 good. good. Bayonetta 2, man. I, it, it, it's one of those games that killed me that I haven't been able to play yet. I've uh, wanted it to try and get it, but... If, we... if you jump over these fires multiple times, they'll burst into money, so speedrunners will money grind. I don't have that kind of timing. Ah, it's one of them dungeons. We're playing Legend of Zelda now. Small key, go to a door. Small key, go to a door. A lot of the dungeons in this game are kind of like that. And I have some points, though this game has some creative locations. And I have some points about some of the later areas we visit. One I learned... A real fun fact, but we will not be bringing that up for hours, but I want to bring up because it's hilarious. I have no idea what you're talking about. What is this? What? Oh. Obvious trap. There's a badge in here that I don't remember where it is that I need to find. If I don't find it, I can't do some later shenanigans. It's not down here, but there is a little outside area. It's at the top of a... Okay. Quick safety save, just in case. Remember kids, always save at your save points. Always save at every save point. Even if you think you got this, save. My aunt once ran past the last per the save point in Parasite Eve, made it to the final boss and died, and then um, was sent back to the save point before that. Obvious trap! Wait, do we have to, we have to fall for the obvious trap? Yes! Yes! Yes, you do, because there's something important 
that this obvious trap leads to. You mean someone important. You call it a yaoi dungeon. Um... That's a dude? No. Car I was gonna make a point. Carson was wrong about that, but... I mean, unless... No. Well, I mean, once we leave those two alone, it could be the yaoi dungeon. I thought yaoi was female. No, that's Yuri. Oh. Yuri is female. Ah, I guess someone accidentally reversed that once. Why are we talking about this? <laughs> Yuri is female, yaoi is guys. Dudes. Um, now if we want to get real technical, Vara is when it's buff dudes. Okay then. I don't think Vara has to technically be two dudes though. I think it just has to be a buff dude. And so it can be Vara and a woman. She's a but then Vara and Yaoi can, you know. Okay, so. So, um, we have two fire members before the next chapter? Yes! This game is weird about that. Also, she is very different than Bobbery. Mm hmm. Just as explosive. All of her abilities are just forms of better exploding. Well, of course, the woman's explosive, am I right? Okay. So. And actually. I love how she was so pissed uh -huh. off, she was just exploding in the corner. Never thought to try over here. Um, that's actually. Little way while I made the obvious cheap joke. That's a thing the game doesn't. Oh, see, they, we, they just stayed there. I guess they want to be part of the Yowie Dungeon. Or they're in PC, so they didn't think to move. Um, I don't know, Carson. From what I've heard, if you get stuck in the Yowie Dungeon, you can't come out. Okay. I never heard anybody. I've heard everyone escaping, escaping the Yowie now? Dungeon. Now? I can show this off. Is she better than Bobbery? No. <laughs> kind of! Because her... Her later abilities? What I was going to say, I find it interesting that the game actually doesn't do the obvious joke was like, a uh, Bombette being like, sweet and stuff, but being explosive and like, angry or something. I just wanted to... Never really yeah, that, I wanted to show that off. See, she's out for a turn. Right. Wait, what? It's a good time to show it off, Carson. Right, mm-hmm. Totally planned and intentional. Yes, because there's a healing point. I know I can... Why, why does she... What? I blew up the ball. See? Oh. I tackled the exploding bomb, and it blew up because physical contact on those bombs, unless it's a certain type of attack, hurts you. So it knocked her out for a turn. But I was right here. I literally knew that would be a good time to show off what we were talking about. That and like later in the game. If I had done an explosion, it wouldn't have... Okay, so now we're back in here. Now I'm gonna go in the other room. There's an extra thing I can get over here if I go back this way. Not the badge I'm looking for. The badge I'm looking for, I believe, is right around the end. There's a badge or a good item or something in here. No, it's right. There we go. How can Bomb Man explode without killing yourself? Open. How can Bobbery? Refund. That, that reminds me of a badge I need to pick up that when I was doing Danger Mario. I didn't pick up this one badge because I thought I wouldn't need it. And then I was using speed running tips and it like, oh, turns out for the final boss to be a little bit easier, you can use this badge. And I was like, damn it. I bet if you step on that same platform, you fall back too, right? I don't think. Oh, that's not tested. The recording's fine, and once it's rendered and stuff. Oh wait. You retro small key. I, oh yeah, I remember where that is. So. Okay, we got to do some. No, wait, not backtracking that way. I just remember where that key was, and it slipped my mind that I didn't pick it up. That's yeah, not that one key, right? It's at the. It's right here. Ow. You can... You can actually attack with... Um... Bomb bad as a... Starting attack? Hold on. I'm, I timed that wrong. 
Like, you can make her explode, and that will enter battle, and enemies will. Unfortunately, I have to take the damage. Because of that party member thing, do they heal at the end of a battle? What? What? The way he, party he's members... Asking, he's asking if a party member is out for like four turns, you use up one, and you go into the yes. next fight, are they still out for three? Nope. Hmm. And we can't get that key yet. Oh, do we get another party member in this dungeon? That's his double jump? No. No. It's like a thousand years ago where you get a party member a chapter like got... for the like first half of the no. game. We you... got two party members this chapter. You kind of... Uh, the thing was Cooper. I thought that was technically no. considered the No, prologue. it... Okay, this thing never falls again. Interesting. So... Okay, so... There's a speedrunning trick to, you set these walls, and you go, and you have to constantly open and close them, mm. but if you spin jump the corners, you can spin jump around the walls, and because of that, you can land on the bridges, because the, there's a bridge behind every wall, and this is just a chronic waste of time. See? So much time. <laughs> Probably should have healed. I might have ended up wasting it. Might have to end up wasting one of my extra items so I can get an easy win. I just need to win until I get a level up, and then I can get the level up. That was your shortcut, wasn't it? No. Oh. Nope. You need to... Remember that key we saw earlier? No. You were being perfectly honest. Okay. That one. Yes. That's what these are for. It's not really a shortcut. Getting close to the end. Really? Well, kind of. There's not much left. Oh, I love this. <laughs> Guess you could call them the heroes on the ha half stairs, <laughs> even though they're villains. Um, how is there a half stairs? <laughs> that was that was pretty bad. Yes. Like, that wasn't even funny. It was more funny that you thought it was funny than no. the and well, I guess humor it... in the joke. My puns are on a whole other level. You just haven't <laughs> achieved it yet. I, clearly. I'm not sure if I oh, want like... to achieve that level. Oh, like Kojima's writing. <laughs> I, I can only assume that man has actually transcended <laughs> to another level that we just don't understand yet. Okay. What was it that was said about? I don't remember. Oh, that was something. Somebody said something about it. I was thinking, unless Koji was actually on a higher plane than the rest of us, which at this point is possible. Yeah. I guess I, if half an A button for us can exist, we can have half stairs. I, I, I believe that Koji was already on a higher plane of existence than we are. It's a hundred, just like thousand year or So I need the one hundred. Okay, actually, I'm unfortunately, I'm right at the end. So that, I that, have to go back for a heart. The end is not too 
far. There's a few enemies you can fight, but the enemies outside, I don't want to deal with. Are you going back for a heart? No, I'm going back to try to find one odd enemy, and then that should get it, because... Actually, you can kind of use that as a shortcut. Oh, crap. Um. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, boy. Okay. Come on. And I'm back at the beginning. There's a Koopa upstairs. Actually, I'm out here so I can just heal. Because that's just... And you will get a level up on the last. What? Okay. No, I need a level up for the boss, oh. but now that I've healed, I can fight the enemies outside with relative ease, or an enemy on the way up. Okay. I'm just gonna cut back to the one room. And we're back. First. That badge I picked up, I was just pointing out the pedestal because that's an important badge. Right. Not... I thought it's one of the... This shit! You can level up on the bullet veils and you can level up on the cannons. So. The bullet veils also fire at random intervals. And. I think this is. I think this is a mushroom, but. You know, your council is a bit. Your castle defense would work a lot. Oh no no, maple syrup. Thanks. Your castle defense would work a lot better if you didn't have blatant ways to avoid it. Hey, remember in Final Seven, there's a back door. In Super Mario World, there's a back door. Oh, uh, but does the back door take you right where you're going? It takes you directly to Bowser. That is 80 flights of stairs. Bulletville's hurt. Like, really. Well, you are getting hit by a bullet. No! The size of your head. There's my level up. I need 10 FP. In case I cut past the battle, we're right at the boss. You can heal. You Remember, can kids. Say every save point. The boss? So, it, um... Not that complicated. Somebody I know is playing Tokyo Mirage. Oh. Um, I can't really turn into Sessions. Sessions? Um, so apparently, from what he told me, the game, and somehow it maintains the balance while doing this, um, apparently, as far as he's, as far as he's played, the game has either been one-sided for him, and he's just obliterated enemies in like one turn, or the game has been one-sided for the enemies. Mm. And somehow the game has maintained that balance, and in that sense has been balanced, because either he gets just completely owned, or he does all of the owning. Mm. Crap. Okay. It's not as much clacking as competitive melee. Oh my gosh. That's clacking the game. So. Gonna heal up again. Market, use every save point. Save again. This boss is actually not that complicated if I do a speedrunning trick, but I need to time it perfectly. And I can mention a thing about that secret weapon they were showing. This bridge doesn't have enough room, so the secret weapon is through the back wall off camera. And as it's rolling in, what it's actually doing is clipping through the wall, but the camera angle doesn't show. Okay. The camera angle doesn't show it clipping. 
Yeah, because it just comes in. See? This is their secret weapon that they were showing Bowser, and this is why How he How did they it. get this into the room? Okay. To, to do speed run. That wasn't a joke. To do speed run tech, I need to do perfect power jumps and perfect bombs. So we don't fight the four Oh, I found it wrong. Damn it. Oh, well, gotta restart. No. Whole I, game. I, I can make up. Ruined. How do you expect to play critical level one mode like this? I, I can. You wouldn't even learn. You wouldn't even earn a cancellation prize at this rate. Consolation. Cancellation. Consolation. I don't care. See, but I, you're I can make up for it. Physically wrong. And there's also a picture of Peach in the back of it's, that. You'll it's see it on the way out. Oh. Okay. Now you fight them. Kind of. You you can see them. Okay. Because I messed up my timing, I, I have to do... Because I messed up my timing in the turn order, I have to do a little bit of finagling. What I have to do is this. Maple syrup, so she can do bomb. Now... Bomb knocks them over. Now... Bomb knocks them over. They're Koopas. Palwalk. Do nothing. They can't do anything. And now... This is why I saved this. E easy first boss. Even though I messed up the timing. If you time it right... You'll get a decent turn. On your way, like, you, you'll time it in a way where they don't really get an attack You just hand. murdered those Koopas. You didn't murder them. We just murdered them. So you now you can see the picture of Peach. Just like we killed that one kid's ride there. And now all the NPC guys are gone. Quiet you. Hey, only I can say quiet you. And now... Wow, I'm the first non-Brazilian person to travel backwards through time. time. Correction, Homer, you're, you're the second. second. That's, That's right, right, Mr. Peabody. Quiet, Quiet you. <laughs> and we didn't do that reference in Simpsons Hit and Run. I was... Why isn't it our family guy Hit and Run? <laughs> anyway. So, this will be... See, family guy needs a successful game now. I thought it had that one PS2 game people said was okay. Right, okay. But then there was the Simpsons game and there was a new bar set. Actually, the bar was set by Simpsons Hit and Run, not the Simpsons game. It's like how the it's like how Final Fantasy set the bar for every RPG ever. I was uh, the end of chapter. Already to argue is that statement, <laughs> but you didn't say so, what I was going to argue with. And what? now a feat section. So. So are you telling me you agree? I'm just going to leave it at that. When do you want to end this recording session? I have no idea. Cause it's. Gone on quite a while. We could well, at least get to the next chapter. Oh, okay. That that'll be fine then. This peak section's not that long. What do you mean we don't play the game in one sitting? And then I can. The next chapter is pretty easy to get to. So. And that'll actually even out the recording. Then I can. See. So, that'll be good then. A lot of this is going to be cut, but it's still going to be nice. To... Now, I'm in full control of Peach. What you're supposed to do, you can't just leave out the door. You're supposed to do this. Why is there a secret? At... Knocks out her what? fireplace. Isn't this her castle or is this Bowser's castle? This is her castle. It's That's on why. Bowser's castle's under hers. Why does Peach have an entrance to the Bat Cave? <laughs> um... Well, who doesn't have a venture to the back cave? This is true, I guess. <laughs> I mean, if somebody said, hey, I can put the en an entrance to the back cave in here for you, before they finish saying that, you're already saying yes. See, you okay. missed your opportunity by letting me finish that sentence. So, what you're supposed to do is read Bowser's diary. That is Bowser's That's an diary. invasion of privacy. And plus, I don't think I want to read that kind of smut fanfiction. <laughs> Uh, I do love his diary entries. 
Uh, that's a way to get around stating oh, what year and time this takes place now. I always hate that sun and star and stuff. I thought it was just zeros. They do. X's and... Mm. You have to keep reading. Mm. Yeah, I was in X's and stars. So. Mm. Okay. It's almost like Mario isn't supposed to have a chronology. What? Oh. He said it's almost like Mario isn't supposed to have a chronology. If I just assumed all the Mario games okay. happened. Yes, they all happened. Like all the Sonic games happened. And nothing more. Okay. <laughs> I feel like I have better things to do with my time than try to figure out the deep underlying plot behind Mario. Tell that the map, Pat. Um, he's not looking for the deep underlying plot. He's looking for Mario's mental issues, which are there. No, no, they're not. I hate that theory was a passion. I love how Twink's hiding behind the chair. Bowser never catches on to how you get out of your room. Even though there's a big red button right there. Yep. See, Carson is his opposite stage. I can see his face breaking. I guess this will be the only time I will be able to get this rant out. Well, the Mario characters are very heavily based off the Popeye characters in the sense of they're designed to do what the scenario needs them to. This is how everything is happening at the same time. It's meant to mimic how in old cartoons sometimes uh, characters would uh, like no. be friends, but other times they would be know. enemies. Star energy works like um, Thousand Year Door. You use it, it takes up the chunk. But you, as you battle, you get pieces, but you can't do the show off stage stuff to get extra in this game. The next chapter! Pretty easy to get into. We just Never have to choose every save point. To do a bit of backtracking. But as a bonus, I can get this. I don't remember what. Oh, on. I'm actually a little short on cash as well, so I need to do. There is an FP plus badge. Good. Good, 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 good. Oh, wait. You, you, just just you just drop off. I need a few more coins. So I'm going to have to get into a battle or two. Because I need to afford something. So. Alright. Underlying Tonic plot. There we go. FP. Uh, Sonic yeah. Generation proves that every Sonic game does happen. The Sonic one doesn't anger me as much as uh, Mario because we uh, don't have a guy passing off his uh, grimdark fanfiction as canon for Sonic. Or at least not in the good parts of the internet. Um, you're apparently not on the same websites as me. I said not in the good parts. Hey, Mario is a jerk. No, that theory is terrible. No, but he is a jerk. He's a jerk because people oh, make no. him a jerk. But, but he's a he is a canonical jerk to Luigi. No, it's the exact opposite. Oh, I, I've only seen one that doesn't actually be nice. Yeah. He, he thinks uh, uh, Luigi at the end of Dark Moon. It just throughout the Mario and uh, Luigi games, it's. Uh, okay, Mario Luigi is like the only time, but even then, you know, everyone's kind of a jerk to Luigi. Yeah, it's like the butt of everyone's joke. Yeah, that's more of uh, everyone is kind of a dick to Luigi and not just Mario. Okay, I'm going to Koopa okay, Village. So me, everyone's a douche. To Luigi because so that's heal. the joke, I guess. Okay, so. But he's an innocent soul. Unless you're, unless you're gonna go with the fan theory that Luigi isn't an innocent soul. 
No, no, he has. Okay. I don't know. Maybe Miss Sorrel wasn't in wasn't at hypnosis. Don't what? actually get me started on that theory too, because <laughs> that one, like most of Matt Pat's recent theories, have been terrible. Because I know this will come up in the, the comments. I don't hate. If there are comments. You like, said the hit and run parts were getting views. I mean, I, I posted a comment on one of your videos. I know you did. And so I'm just going to state this now. I uh, don't hate uh, Matt Pat and Game Theory. It's just recently he's had this ego about his theories actually being canon, especially with the Mario videos, and okay. that's what bothers me in most of his modern things. I... When I said rival, I wasn't kidding. No. Why is this still a thing? He's a thing through the entire game. And I love him. You... I, I kind of don't want to spoil it, because shit happens. Weird things happen. Does he become Bowser? No. no. So, so this isn't like the whole Ridley thing in other M. Look, he's, he look, constantly look, gets better, to, like, like this. You have to put up a spoiler warning on this. Because I'm spoiling all sorts of games. Most of the games we've spoiled are over six years old. Not other M. It's not like six years old, it was in 2010, wasn't it? Oh, wait, I could have shown off something. Are you showing me off now? Oh, wait, no. No, wait, I didn't equip that badge because I didn't have the points yet. So, never mind. It's an important badge, but because I know I'm at town and I can just do this and beat him rather easily before we go to the next. Because he's defensive, which is unfortunate. Might have to. Oh, wait, no. She was just strong enough. Good. Hammer might have been. He is a constant rival. And he gets better throughout the game. It's great. Let's never forget, there's always the possibility that you killed both that one guy's Razza. So. <laughs> Carson's giving Sean the shit eye. <laughs> Hey, I do like the thought that you know, the other uh, the alternative to that entire thing was that you could have killed both those rad the Rose Radica and the Radicate. But that's like extremely dark. <laughs> that makes it look like Red's out to get somebody. <laughs> Maybe he is. Hey, we we all agree that Red fell off of Mount Silver, right? Does that Charizard have fly? Oh. Does it? Does it? I don't believe it. No, no, it doesn't. It had sounds, just... sounds like a server research to me. I feel like Pretty it had sure. fly in gold and silver. Hey, in gold okay. and silver, um, the originals he had an Espeon. Yeah. Now we're. This is why I needed money. The badge shop opens, except the badges that appear. Oh my God! It would be a speedrunner's dream. Speedy span. First try. And I got exactly enough. Oh, speedy span. I'm taking something off. By dizzy attack. Actually, because of d dizzy attacks off, I can do that. We all agree that red fell off Mount Silver, right? Oh, speedy span. Look at this. I don't think he walked past Silver. Or gold, I'm sorry. I don't think you walked past gold. Uh, your gold silvers the dick. I, th I think he fell off. Oh wait, first. Never could find this as a kid. What is this? Well, is that... But the funny thing about that isn't that, um... Oh wait, or is... Which one is the protagonist of black and white? Isn't he white? Actually, their names aren't oh, exactly just Oh wait, no, wait. Black, like... Black got rushed around. They, uh, they started giving him actual names. Not in the manga. Well, actually, you no. Know, um, in Black and... This is how you get the chapter, too. Actually, in Black and 
why so, it's not. Those characters don't have names. Now, an interesting thing in black and white, <laughs> Bianca, her name is similar to Bianco, which is the Italian word for white, and the guy I can't remember the name of, his name is similar to a word for black, so... But the characters in that game don't have names. Not like, um, Brendan and May. No, they do. Why is everyone calling black and white? Because they're wrong. But they do have names, I just can't remember them off the top of my head. But the male and female trainers do have names. They have kind of names, it's just... I feel like one of them is Hilda for some reason, and I don't know why. Oh wait, you're right. No, wait. Chapter 2! I thought Hilda the was mystery Gen 1's. of Dry Dry Ruins. Like I said, I can't remember. Okay! Probably about to call this a session, because there's a save point right remember here. Remember kids, save at every save point. Got plenty of recording, too. So? Um, you can't save at every save point. Okay, I am going to call this a session because it's getting late here for recording in the middle of the night, so... Like sensible people. Mm-hmm. See, see you next recording. Whenever Sean comes back for this, even though you're probably not going to see this for months.